of the local winners of the great Christmas light fight last year has decided to move his display this year. Yeah, he is searching for a new home to put on the show and he needs your help to find a neighborhood that will welcome the show with open arms, his light show. Our Stephanie Lopez shows us where the display is now and why he moved it in the first place. Thousands of Christmas lights, a $1,600 monthly power bill. Bobby Moore is serious about Christmas, and it's why he won the great Christmas light fight last year. And the yard blew up. We put up more than we'd ever put up, and traffic blew up, and it ended up being one of the most amazing experiences I've ever had in my life. But this year, his yard is almost bare. With medical issues popping up, Bobby has chosen to retire this year. It's something he said many times before, a running joke in the family. You know, I've talked to the assistant living facilities that he's moving into, and they won't let him bring all the lights there. The display is now up in his son's yard on the 600 block of Country View Lane in Raleigh. As he searches for a new home that will welcome the twinkling lights and the onlookers. We've got to find a place that loves Christmas lights and will not mind a little bit of traffic every now and then because that goes hand in hand with these Christmas lights. And Bobby needs your help to find a new home in a neighborhood that loves Christmas displays. He's looking for a ranch style home in Wake County on lots of land to put up lots of lights. But after 21 years of putting up a grandiose show that takes months of work to put up and hundreds of dollars to light, why does Bobby do it? for moments like this. We had a family come up last year that had a child that was vision impaired. So we took the child into the display, got him up close to us so we could actually touch the displays and the child's face just boomed, just lit up like a light bulb.